Oh, this one? Yeah, but they're at 2.5. Like, I can just I can just suppress everywhere for that. Oh, it's because... Ah, there's a scroll bar here. It's just not showing them all. Gotcha. Yeah, they're just further down. We'll just keep fighting the rebels as we can, and then... Hi, rebels. Okay, 50 more Horde Cursed Rebels. True Forge Hall. It's basically all of the... It's all of the holds, isn't it? Base. All of the holds got base unrest. 13.34. I bet if we went through every hold we have, even ones that have no reason to have unrest, all gained that base unrest. Is this, is this event supposed to, like, fracture the refounded Dwarven Empire into, like, a whole bunch of independent little derps? Seems the way to me. We're still over the governing capacity. I actually think the governing capacity is worth maybe doing here. All right, so I'm gonna march to here. We just, we just gotta stay ahead of the game and hope that we don't get another 3,000 uh, 3, gold event. Not my rebels, right? This one's only 17k. The banks are in good health. After several tumultuous months, we have finally adjusted the accounts of our banks. Pay some of their debt to encourage fairness. We can now continue with our reforms. Okay. So I can continue with them, but I didn't actually get to reduce the interest on the uh, on the loans. So all of these loans still do have 11% interest per year. Yuck. A 418 gold loan is 617 gold to pay back. It's horrible. Check decisions. Ah, new currency reform for 150 admin points. And 15, 1,400 crowns, we get interest per annum minus 8, reduced inflation cost minus 50, until the end of the game? Until the end of the game? Is it actually going to persist after the disaster, taking us to 1% interest? That'd be sick. It's just there till the disaster disappears? Ah, misleading. Well, I'm not really getting a lot out of this, inflation-wise. I have the admin points. Reducing the interest per annum. I think we just do it. We just do it now. Go deeper into debt, it's fine. Okay, so all of these clicks are... Ah, shoot, actually, I just made a mistake. That was another example of a scaled wealth click. We could have... we could have done the thing. Not bad. True Forge Hall? What the hell's that? That's fake something. True Forge Hall is this one? Nope. I don't know where my halls are, man. It's a Jace. Ah, it's adjacent. Ah, okay. It is Mithril Hold. Got it.
Yeah, we just gotta go clear out all the holes, it looks like. Corruption uh, is on the rise. I don't like how the corruption's affecting our tech costs and all power costs and stuff, so... I think, I think it's corruption next, although... You guys did vote for Slaves second place. Corruption distant third, so Slaves, I guess? Sure. Might be a good idea to possibly build up our economy a bit before we try to take the next stage. Just try to pay back some of the loans. These do retroactively update, so they're back down to 3%. Actually... Purging the interest from the banks gave us minus 10 inflation. How much do you want to bet doing the corruption tree is going to give us minus some percent of corruption? Maybe we should debase currency. Use debased currency to possibly pay off the loans. 10,000%? I bet. I bet it does. Try it. The downside to the corruption is um, it's just all power costs, really. This level of corruption gives national unrest minus 0.62. All power costs go up. Autonomy goes up. And spy network. Yeah, I don't think we care. Let's just not even root it out. Just let it grow. We're already at three. I'm going to go to like seven. Please use Diplomat? On what? Maybe I don't even pay off the loans, actually. Like... We're probably just gonna have to take more for some of these events. Alright, let's prepare for another click. Let's send all of our money away. Cheese. I like cheese. Do you like cheese? I like cheese. Maybe there, is there a faster way to do that? Hmm. Not really from that menu. Can you debase just when we get the event? True. Yeah, we probably could do it that way. Can't fill that in. Can't fill that in. Don't necessarily want to board this guy yet. I think we might be out of places to colonize. Unless we're willing to fill in the adjacencies. Or we can colonize out here again. I guess we do that. Okay, I'll probably want to suppress rebels across the country to get rid of this 30% one before it gets any bigger. Okay, our income is supposed to be low right now. Trade income is in the, ta in the tank. Alright, you guys chose, right? So you guys wanted to do slaves next. Focus on fair pay or focus on working hours? This will have permanent consequences. Hmm. Working hours. That makes me think that they work less, which means reduced goods produced or reduced production efficiency, maybe. Fair pay probably is a malice to like tax revenue or something. Yeah, we want to err toward production. We want we want more production, so let's just pay them well. I'll just pay them. Fine. Fair pay. Everyone deserves a livable wage. Come on, man. Except for orcs. They don't deserve shit. Okay, next hold is probably that one. And elves, yeah. Yeah, elves suck. Nobody likes elves. 
Mm -hmm. Okay, um, for a few months here, we actually do want to be making money. Trade income, go trade income goes from 21 to 58. We have 40 ducat and uh, 40 ducat per month annuals like like swing that we can do on command. Kind of good. We're 3,000 ducats in debt at the moment. TP's a bit small right now. Oh, okay. We haven't done any insults in a while. Let's sync those up right now. Do a regular insult on this guy. Also, I don't think I have an embargo active. I forgot about embargoes with these characters, these countries. We embargo both of those, and then there's Grombar. He has been embargoed. It's fine. We'll get all of our money back by taxing our neighbors. Seventy percent on these ones. These guys are mad in Dagonron and Glory Hold. Hold on, Glory Hold. So Glory Hold's at seventy percent. Doesn't really make any difference to me which one we take care of first. Let's go take care of that one. Can I show you the world powers? Sure. We're in third place right now. The command does not have colonialism. Otherwise, we're actually pretty close, though. Well, they'll be in first place once they have colonialism. Hmm. So should we take tech or wait? I'm gonna wait till corruption's gone, then we'll take tech. Nishti. The proper solution to being horde cursed is murder all of your subjects. Just just murder them all. It's great. If you kill them all, they'll stop being greedy little bastards. That's the, the moral of this story that I've learned, for sure. Beautiful cavern profit. Say money. I like money. You like money? I like money. Next is 80% in hold on, which we're going to take care of right now. You're not allowed to retreat there. I'm not allowed to go there. This is not okay. Adequate pay and rem remuneration. Remuneration. With our hard work, we have managed to race to reach force. To reach force. <laughs> to reach quote. Okay, so it's like bunny ears force. <laughs> A deal with cartels. From now on, all work will be remuner- Is that the right way of writing that word? I thought it was renumerated. Isn't it R-E-N-U-M? Isn't it backwards? Or am I insane? Is it remunerated? It's renumeration. I'm wrong. It is. It is. Is M U N. Okay. For some reason, I thought it was the other way. Re. Weird. It's weird when your brain's just wrong. Just straight up wrong. 
lose 1450 uh, 1445 crowns and we gain pay reforms till the end of the game not really lose production efficiency but gain national tax modifier Ugh. that's a horrible trade production's way better than taxes we chose wrong chat why would you choose this if this is actually permanent forever then this is horrible <laughs> Reload. I don't think I saved halfway through, and I only have on annual, uh, semi-annual autosaves. I kind of want to just, just check and see if it's a simple binary, like, that one goes this way, this the other one goes the other way. So let's at least reload the last save and just see if we already done the click. We had already done it at this point. So we'd have to go back to the first of the year. Why would you get less production for paying fair? I don't know. Logically, it didn't make sense to me either. I, I thought that we chose the right one. We'd actually already done it this far back as well. Last chance. Oldest autosave? You get to keep less of what they produce, but they pay more in taxes. Okay, kind of makes sense. Alright, so we have not done it yet here. We were still fighting rebels and stuff. Well, let's give it a try. I want to see. Trading comes low. So last time we did fair pay. Let's try working hours. This disaster is brutal. It's pretty well made. I mean, I, I actually think it's it's great. It's challenging enough that if you if you don't know the game mechanics super well and and plan in advance to to handle it, you have just a tiny bit of unrest in some places. Don where? Dong, Dong Gulag. So a tiny bit of unrest out here. Op Centaur, Large Oppressed, plus four. But the corruption's actually helping. There goes the... 76k rebellion or whatever it was. And while we're doing this disaster train, at least the, the digging is, is happening. It's almost done. Oh, these guys aren't even at 50% yet. Oh, right. Yeah, PP. Thanks. We had insulted and then issued embargoes on our other rival. Mm -hmm. The hole called bankruptcy. I can lose 100 ducats to give our subjects some money. Hmm. Such, such a shame, man. Good luck with your bankruptcy. Not my problem.
<laughs> what do the great powers look like now? Same as they did the last time we tried it. We're still in third place. I looked at it just a minute ago, didn't I? Cobalt Daycare. Really? Cobalt Daycare is going to spawn 9k troops out of one province at 9 dev? I'll just raise autonomy here, whatever. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, so now it's just hold on. So we'll just back off. Because they're not going to go to 50% if I have the army standing here. Hey, where's my click? Is this just the standard Anbinar An An mod? Anbinar plus like some UI stuff, but yeah. There's, there's no other mods being used, it's just Anbinar. And it's solid. I did the click, right? Where's the next event? What's happening, even? The Bitbucket, ver Bitbucket version. What? What? Bitbucket? Okay, so this is the... I, I, I did the second, the other option. With our hard work, we have managed to reach a deal with the cartels. Now, hours spent working can no longer encroach on the lives and health of the employees. So this is better for unrest. So they, they both, they're both bad for production. One's production efficiency, one is goods produced. I mean, having national unrest minus 1.5, is this one also permanent permanent? There's a GitHub version that's more up to date. Um, goods produced versus production efficiency. I think you would rather have the goods produced. Because goods produced affects, it affects trade income. While production efficiency is just going to end up getting dwarfed by trade. It's already dwarfed by trade. Our trade income is still higher even though we only have a 1%. Like we have penalties right now to taxes and trade. No penalties to production. And yet our income is still higher from trade. So losing production efficiency isn't that big of a deal versus losing goods produced, which is everything. You could also keep them enslaved. How do you how do you do that? Yeah, I think I'd rather have production efficiency minus 20 versus goods produced minus 10. Alright, let's uh, let this event sit on the screen for a sec. We'll lower our income to reduce the cost of this click. You actually can update it after the fact. The number is 1445. It will change. Serpent Smite. Is this the end? The mountains themselves seem to roar with rage. As an earthquake, unlike any scene in living memory, shakes our hold to its very core. Great cracks form in the rock, swallowing buildings whole. And rubble falls from above, shattering structures and burying dwarves alive. God, there's a lot of shit going down in our country right now. Jesus. For a full hour, the quake continues, reaping ever more damage as the seconds go by. And then, just as suddenly as it began, it ceases. The damage is immense, and many of the resources, many of our resources are taken up, simply keeping our hold in one piece. Now, however, a choice now lies before us. This great quake, which split open the core of our hold, has revealed many precious minerals that were previously undiscovered. Due to the unstable nature of the fissures, 
Access to these minerals will be sh will likely be short-lived. We could devote effort to harvesting these resources, but this would surely take away from the efforts to rescue and treat survivors. 20% chance that Minas Tirith will now produce mithril. 35% chance it produces iron. 45% chance it produces copper. We get pristine deposits until 1629. Old infrastructure metropolis will be removed. So we lose the metropolis. Metropolis is the thing that gives us an extra minus 30% dev cost. No, it's not. It just gives us tax modifier 0.5 goods produced. What was the th It was the old hold that gave the dev cost. We're not losing that. It says at the bottom there, hold infrastructure metropolis will be removed. Why would it not be removed? Or the wounded must be cared for. Unknown will now be produced. So we get to re-roll the trade good? I'm kind of curious here because it is possible for the capital to roll... This this province can, can roll mithril anyway. So just out of curiosity, like, we don't get the stab here, but I want to see. It should set the trade good to unknown. And then if we go to the trade goods map mode, it has a... Oh, it's only a 4.4% chance of mithril. Pretty low. It was a uh, paper before, I think. Let's just see what it rolls. So many pop-ups. Switched it to copper. Hmm. So, I don't know. The top option, losing the the thing. I don't understand why, but some people are saying that it's not it's not going to make us lose the whole infrastructure. I'm just going to try it. We got iron. Iron's worse than copper. <gasps> Local construction time minus 20 though. Oh, that's really good. That's really good. Minus 20% construction time allows us to have... Um, faster hold construction. No, I want iron. I'm happy with that. I'm totally fine with this outcome. Like, we need to do another, like, we're only, we're about to hit, in, in less than half a year, we're gonna, we're gonna hit tier 5 dig. Tier 5 diggy dig. And, uh... Seems fine. About to get access to the state house. Naval battery? What's a naval? 